Former Strictly Come Dancing star Ian Waite has revealed he believes the judges on the BBC show have some idea about the celebrities' routines ahead of the live shows. The former professional was part of the BBC dance show from 2004 to 2006 and danced with the likes of Zoe Ball, Micah Paris and Denise Lewis. Throughout his time on Strictly, Ian faced his fair share of critiques from the judges, with Craig Revel Horwood often leaving the audience unimpressed with his low scores. However, it seems as though Ian believes the judges may get a sneak peek at the routines before they perform on the night. Speaking with Spin Genie, the former Strictly star was asked whether or not there were any backstage secrets he could share from his time on the show. He replied, On It Takes Two we kind of tell you everything that happens because that's the nature of the show, so what is there to tell? I think the judges must know, I don't know how, but the judges must know, they must see footage from the week because I don't know how they can surmise you in one show. There must be prep before they go into the main show because otherwise you would enty know where to place people and you would enty know how good people are going to be. There's got to be prep work but I think that's a good thing because I think you kind of need to know. Last weekend, Strictly fans welcomed 15 new celebrities to the dance floor for their debut performances with their professional partners. From the Cha Cha Cha, Samba and Jives, the first live show of the series was full of glitz and glamour. Although it was casualties Nigel Harmon who stole the show with his partner Katya Jones with their Paso Doble. Dancing to Smells Like Teen Spirit by Nirvana, their routine blew the judges away as they flew straight to the top of the leaderboard with a score of 32. Contestants Amanda Abington, Bobby Brazier, Ellie Leach and Leighton Williams were all following close behind Nigel with scores of 29. However, on the other end of the spectrum, Les Dennis found himself at the bottom of the leaderboard with a score of 16. This Saturday, the leaderboard is all set to change when the couples take to the dance floor again with their new score being added to the first live shows. Strictly Come Dancing continues Saturday on BBC One from 6.20pm.